Hello there. <laughs> I got that. Oh, no. <laughs> I am tired, but I'm Hello there! Today we are in sunny Australia. Sorry, what are you having again? Plastic surgery. As some of you might know, I've had four already. Okay. I have Alison Dawn with me. The Dawn. Oh my god. So I'll be manning the camera. Don't make it weird. So I'm going in for my fifth plastic surgery today. I've mentioned that I've had four in a couple other videos. Hey, mm -hmm. I just want to know, can you count on one hand how many cosmetic surgeries you've had? I can. <laughs> Wait, no, it's not. Is it five? I don't know. I can't believe you know. How many plastic surgeries have you had? Jack went in before you finish the question. So? What are the rules? Four. Four. Correct. And everyone wants to know what they are. This is going to be my fifth boob job. <laughs> oh, it's just like embarrassing. Like I have never spoken about it because it's embarrassing, you know? But it shouldn't be, you know? Like I'm getting obviously less and less embarrassed as, well as I like live my life. Well, how could you care after five? Grow old, okay. Uh. It all started when I was a young lady, a young woman, as I should say. And I had different sized boobs. <laughs> as most women do. Can you stop it? <laughs> Alrighty, we get it. We get it. But I had more than most. I had an A and a C, which don't make that face. This is why I'm embarrassed to talk about it. I'm <laughs> just trying to normalize this for other women who might have the same issue and to show them that it's okay to be yourself. But it's not. And I got surgery. Oh, I'm kidding. <laughs> so I went in and I saw Dr. Okay, so I went in, I got my A turned into a C with a breast augmentation, also known as a, uh, what's it called? Implant. Got a silicone implant. Mm. Okay, and then I got fat. <laughs> That's where it all went downhill. So like, the first couple might not have been all of her fault. It was like right after high school that I got the first one done. And then like a year or so later, I put on like 10 pounds. And then because one was silicone and one was real, the real one grew and the silicone one did not because it's silicone mm. and silicone doesn't grow. Then I went back because I was fat, I didn't want to have huge boobs. I was like, take out the implant, make the other one small, we call it a day. She said no. She was like, I'm not gonna remove healthy breast tissue. I know, it was so stupid. I was like, what's a breast reduction then? Bitch. So I went and I got a second opinion because I was like, take it out. Like, I don't want this implant in me anymore. I could like move it from side to side. Ew. Itty bitty titty committee. <laughs> Hurrah. Like, I want to be a part of that. She said no. She like fixed them up again, left the implant in. Then I put on like 10 more pounds. This Let's sounds it. like it's your fault. Okay, the first <laughs> few are my fault. Well, if she had just taken it out and made them both small, then they would have both been small. And then I would have just had like, just the breast tissue. It would have been like way less severe at least. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. But I see what you're saying, but you gotta see what I'm saying. Weight fluctuates. That's just life, ladies. Then I had triple Ds. Mind you, I am 5'2 <laughs> on a good day. <laughs> it was so bad. And like, that just does not fit my personality. I couldn't wear like the t-shirts that I wanted to wear. I would go and I would get a small sports bra and I would put that on and then I put a medium on top of it. <laughs> and that would be like my daily. And it was so uncomfortable, was so sweaty up in there. Like the worst thing ever. So I went back and I said, Help! This is the reason I kept going back to the, the same surgeon was because it was free. Well, the first one was covered by Medicare because they were so different. They were like, <laughs> yeah, you 
insurance baby and then the rest of them it was like under the same insurance or like because it was her up then she just did it for free and whatever so then I had little boobies and then one was like off to the side so I went back to her and I was like hey what <laughs> and then she fixed that and that was number four right so that was in February of this of 2018 so she fixed them they looked great whatever but what they don't tell you is over time skin moves and stretches and like especially my skin my tin skin is thin sorry ladies not everyone has perfect perky boobs and like whatever i'm over it that brings us to number five and here i am same doctor same situation number five i am over it let me tell you <laughs> if this does not work out i will not be going back to that's it. I am cutting her off. I'm done there. You know? Like, yeah. that is a chapter of my life that I would like to close. I know I should get a different Well, why didn't you listen to the same? No, because, because I just listen to my mommy. <laughs> and my mommy says, this is free, girly, you get it. And my mommy also says, <laughs> I gave her a few chances because at the beginning, I was fluctuating a lot in weight. But now I don't anymore. So it's like, this video <laughs> is sponsored by Squarespace. <laughs> You'll get it right the first time. <laughs> Squarespace is the all in one platform that you need to design a website, domain, or online shop. I personally love Squarespace because it is incredibly user friendly. The beautiful designer templates makes your website or domain look extremely professional. And if you ever have a question, Squarespace provides award winning 24 7 customer service. It's super simple to set up or transfer your domain on Squarespace. Put your plans into action and make it with Squarespace because they are offering anyone who is watching this video a free trial as well as 10% off your first website or domain using my link squarespace.com slash amy oddman also linked in the description box below i hope that i answered all the questions that you guys had if you have more leave them down below and i'll freaking get to it i don't know i thought that it would be fun to fun <laughs> so i thought that i would do like a little plastic surgery vlog. And then I take you guys along to see what I've gone through for all the times before this. Sorry, can you sense that I'm frustrated with the turnout of this? Let's go! <laughs> Hello there. We are at North Shore Private Hospital in Sydney, Australia. We're in the waiting room. And definitely not allowed to film in here. Mm -mm. My mum just went to the loo and she's coming back. That's me mum, and me mum's car. Oh. <laughs> she's pretty camera shy, and she's very got camera shy. a nice Australian accent. <laughs> Just kidding, you she's from South that. Africa. <laughs> Should I speak like that the whole time? Because I mean, I'm you've pretty done sure it. that I haven't said a single thing like in my actual accent. What? This isn't your actual accent? In my actual accent? This is my actual accent. <laughs> I'm gonna talk normally now. Okay. Hello there. <laughs> no, I'm not nervous. I'm actually rather excited. I hope they take me in ASAP, Rocky, because the faster I get in, the faster I can eat. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. Thank you. I guess I shouldn't do that. On video, this is the last time I'm coming. Just because I'll have to this one. Okay. 
Oh, this much. I got that. <laughs> I'll take you away now. It looks more like more patient then. <laughs> Two hours later. Hi. Hello there. <laughs> What's cooking? Good looking? Nothing. How I, was it? Oh my god. It was like amazing. I loved every second of it. I was asleep <laughs> so I have no idea. Hopefully good. I was really annoying the one nurse. Mm -hmm. So then she gave me a different nurse. <gasps> she was like, this is Winnie. <laughs> <laughs> Now, when you went to go get me some anti nausea. Oh, no. <laughs> I'm awake, I'm alive, I'm thriving. Trigger warning if you don't like blood, skip five seconds. <laughs> Should I show my dreams? No. Show them. Too gross, too gross. <gasps> Ugh. Ew, don't make that face. It's uh, so bright. Have you seen it? Seen what? My tip? Mm hmm. Uh -uh. When I, do you get to see it? Next week. Oh yeah. What? I'm, I'm wrapped. Oh, you don't know if it's if it's good or not. Well, I'm not gonna know if it's good or not for like months. Oh, that sucks. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Sleep here tonight. I'm just a bit tired, mm -hmm. but otherwise feeling good. It's Scorpio season, so I like feel strong. I love Scorpio season. That's my freaking season. Yeah, I know. That's why you love it. I'm a triple Scorp. Sun, moon, rising Scorpio, so I'm strong. Evil. Evil? What? That's what it means. <laughs> That's what Scorpio means? Yeah. Evil? Yeah. No, Scorpios are the best. I haven't heard great things. It is currently 11.18. Can you see this? And I can't sleep. They have given me painkillers and whatever. And like, I definitely should be passed out right now. I haven't slept a wink since I woke up from surgery at three. So it's pretty interesting. I don't know. I am tired, but I just can't sleep. It is now 2.19. Thought I'd do a little hospital mukbang. I have plain white bread with some strawberry jam. Wake up. It's a few days later. I had my surgery on Wednesday. It is Sunday. I feel fine. Everything is itchy, but I think that that's normal. Fifth and final. We'll see. I don't know. I haven't spoken about any of this online before, so be nice. Please. Oh, oh, oh. A rubber! Oh no! Oh, goodness gracious! We're getting robbed! <laughs> <laughs> Hello! Oh god! <laughs> Leave any comments down below if you have any more questions. Give this video a thumbs up. Maybe I'll do an update? I don't know! Do you care about this? My name's Amy Elman. My videos are everyone's daddy. So if that kind of thing, subscribe and hit the bell! That's Teddy. Oh. She's blind and deaf. Okay, so listen like, though. She doesn't she know what's going on. Hi! The thumbnail. <laughs> <laughs> if you're thinking about getting a breast reduction, I say get it because it was the best thing freaking ever. How many would you recommend getting? Seven. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I started all different. So like I get that it's hard and I don't fully blame my doctor for how hard it was. That's my disclaimer. Thanks. See ya. Oh. <laughs>